Hi guys, welcome to Stairs. This is, I, I, th I think I found this game on Game Jolt. I don't remember what it was about. The screenshots were just terrifying and I've been putting it off for a while because I don't want to play it. <laughs> I don't like being scared, but um, that's generally why what's happened. That's generally what's happening if I'm putting a game off and I'm not playing it. It's because I stare at the icon and go, am I really in the mood to jump out of my skin and probably scream a lot? Yes, no, maybe. <laughs> anyway, so, but I really need to start kind of being more like, I need to record this because it doesn't matter if I get scared or not. People want to see it and I want to give them what they want. So that's really the more mindset that I want to need to get into more. But anyway, so let's go ahead and jump in here and see what this is about. Kickstarter demo. Ooh. You are an urban explorer looking into an old experimental facility. Rumor has it that some of the experiments performed there were not only illegal, but also supernatural. Some say that whatever they were testing is still there stalking the facility. With a loud clang, with a loud clang, a door close behind you closes and locks you in. The only way out now is down. Lovely. I'm obviously insane. creepy. Okay. WSD keys to move, mouse to look around. What kind of shitty ass flashlight is this? Okay, like, now when I was a kid, I lived in Florida for like a long time. Like most of my memory memories are Florida, but um, and we lived in the middle of nowhere. This was a, you can sprint while holding shift and W, okay. Um, this was a tiny ass ho house that was built by my family's own hands and was sinking into the swamp. And that's exactly where it was built. A swamp in the middle of fucking nowhere. And um... Ooh. Why? Sorry, I'm listening right now. But, um, I'm listening. Oh, God, that's creepy. What is that? We're inside. Open Get the us door. Out. Get us out of here. Did I just hear somebody say fuck? Uh, I don't blame them. What kind of shitty flashlight is this? I hate this! Uh, anyway, so... So yeah, we lived in this swamp. In the middle of nowhere. And when it got dark at night, it got dark. Cause there were no street lamps or anything around to light it. And it was sort of a farm, but not really by the time that I got there. Oh, look, I can see myself. It was it was a farm when my granny and her kids were there. Like my granny was uh, younger, her kids were still there and there were children. That's when it was a farm. So naturally they were on the prowl for any kind of animals that were after their farm animals. And I'm talking animals like crocs, raccoons, foxes, uh, Snakes, boars. I don't know if there were bears down there. I doubt it. I've never seen a bear down there. Never heard of a, being, a bear being down there. But like the most vivid animal that I definitely remember being down there was a boar and her family. But uh, yeah. So they had those huge, palm sized, metal, like stainless steel flashlights that would be like lighting up the whole damn woods because that's what it was surrounded by on all four sides woods but yeah i'm like that's why i'm sitting here like what kind of shitty flashlight would you bring into a place that you were urban exploring why are you stupid anyway yeah so in stairs christopher adams is equipped with a camera by pressing the right mouse button default while standing still you will activate the camera while the camera is activate you can take, take photos by pressing the left mouse button default the to put away the camera press the right mouse button while it is active press C 
while the camera is active to view the photo in library. Navigate the library by using A and D keys. You can delete the pictures you don't want by looking at them and pressing the delete key. Whew, hard to breathe. You can choose enter to confirm your choice. Pay attention to your surroundings. You never know when you need a lot of info in on the move. What? Cancel back. Confirm. Library. Navigate photo library. Activate camera. Take photo. Delete photo. Oh, that's fucked up! Oh! Okay. Whoa, that was... This is kinda cool! Scary as shit! fucking kidding me. Are you kidding me with this shit right now? Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. It's just a game. It's just a game. It's just a game. You're okay. It's just a game. Stop! Oh my god, there's too much noise happening around me. Is there a reason I can crawl in here? Is there a fucking reason I can crawl in here? What is this shit? Is this banish mixed with like... Spanish mixed with the freaking game with the Japanese girl with the camera and that's the only way you can see the monsters mixed with I am very uncomfortable right now. I don't want to play this. I am not good at horror games. Map. There should be an archive. The archive should be marked out on it. Oh, I was probably supposed to press E at the, the front of the door. They should really, uh, you know, m the E thing should be when you first run into that door where people are like, "Help us!" Ah! Okay. What are we looking for? An archive. Archives. A two. Great! Great! In the basement. Awesome! Sweet! Yeah, that's where we want to go. This is Dr. Gene Elm, recording after a successful experiment on subject 731. If we achieve our goals here, there is no end to what we can do. Humanity will have powers never thought possible. Fuck you, man. Like, okay. I hate this game already. Fuck that shit! What did I just hear? Excuse me? The monster probably just ran down fucking by and I didn't see it. Fuck you! basement is? Hold on. 
I didn't get a good look at where I'm going. Where the fuck am I? Um, I'd love a you so I could tell where I am. Security, machine room. What is this? Is this security? I assume this is security, which is A1. Oh, okay, so this is a red dot. I'm sorry. I'm stupid. Okay. So we come out of here, and we go... It's not showing the two doors. I don't understand. Because there should be a door... I'm just gonna end up wandering around. Well, I assume that I'm going the right way since I s found that thing. And it made noise and I'm finding the monster. So I assume- this is the shittiest flashlight in the world. I hate this. I'm not getting close to that. Hello? Hello. Any monsters want to eat my guts? There's not many of them. Considering I'm scared shitless right now. Ah, I'm stuck! Okay. There's nothing like getting stuck when there's a monster running around and like... You can't move and it's just like, well, that's great. That happened in Wick. I got stuck. Cause Lillian like teleported me into a damn wall and I was just like, well, I guess this is where it ends. Hello? Something went wrong. I, I locked all the doors I could. It should keep it inside. For now. We have to contain it. And yet here I am. Opening all the doors! Fuck me, I'm an idiot. This is why you don't go urban exploring. You don't know what you're about to let out. You're probably gonna die. I'm just kidding. Urban exploring, exploring, oh god. No? Okay. Urban exploring sounds really amazing, but like, breaking and entering does not. Which a lot of people tend to do because a lot of places are closed down for a specific fucking reason. Namely, that they're dangerous and you shouldn't be going in there. And Because the fucking floors will probably fall out underneath you and the ceiling will collapse in on top of you. That's usually why places are locked down. Let's just walk into this dark ass hallway. There's literally nothing down there. Let's not walk into that dark ass hallway. Uh, okay, well... Nothing's opening, so... Oh, I forgot this play. Oh, that's the other side of that one door, okay. Well, that's cool, at least it loops around. And it's not just an area that's like completely closed off. Oh, that's the basement. I need power for the basement. Or a key card or something. I'm itchy. Stop itching. What was I rambling about earlier? Why is this scary? Because it's dark and creepy and I heard something running around. And I'm easily scared. Ah! I downloaded all these Gmod horror maps thinking, you know, I'll play these. Cause like, if you've ever seen Gmod horror maps, a lot of them are really shitty. Um, not, not all of them. Some of them are really good and I don't know what it takes to really make those. So I can't really say much, but I'm saying shitty as in, ah! A picture that you just threw in my face and made a loud sound with. Ah! Which is scary because it's fucking startling as hell. But it's cheap. And everybody knows that. Um. Did this door shut for real? Or did I shut it? Well, I'm still hearing things running around, so that's good. That's a good sign. Anyway. Uh, okay, yeah, uh, something is definitely running around here. I 
I don't like the gaping hole. Oh, and my shadow is a little bit scary too, but um. Yeah. So yeah. Okay, can it actually kill me? Should I actually be that aware for of it? But um. What was I- what the fuck was I saying? Jesus Christ. I keep losing my train of thought. Hello? I've also noticed that's- that's- Okay... Please don't do that to me. I jumped so fucking hard. Okay, this is a room. That's interesting. Alright. Uh, clickety. Only the dim light of hope to keep you going until that is snuffed out. For everyone that falls, we shall feast until the next fall. Silence will follow, then silence and slow death. That's very promising and ominous as hell. Okay, well, fuck you. Fuck this. <laughs> since it's decided- I was gonna try and play until I got scared pretty good, but apparently it doesn't want to do that since I'm running on 16 minutes now. 17, actually. But, um... Anyway, I guess I'll try to play more of this if I manage to work up the nerve at some point. I do need other games to play, though. I'm running out of games, like... Ugh. But, um, anyway, so... Oh, yeah, I'm gonna try and stop saying, but, um... Apparently, I'm a drum, so... <laughs> like, I've noticed that in all of my editing sessions, I'm always, but, um, but, um, but, um, but, um, but, um... So, yeah. Anyway, so I will see you in the next one. I hope you enjoyed. I got scared by a light. That says a lot about me. And alrighty. See you in the next one.